I'm here at the Brit Awards with the lady of the night. It's Lady Gaga. Hello. Hi. How are you? How are you? Wow, you've won three awards. How are you? I'm just like completely overwhelmed and I'm, I just love my fans so much. My little monsters are everything to <laughs> me. And um, I really did not expect to win all three tonight or really any at all. So I'm just so excited and I'm, I'm just really, thank you. It's okay. It's not what it wasn't just me. Well. <laughs> it's Radio 1 and... Thank you for playing my music. Yeah. I remember the first time I met you, um, you came into the studios. We'd never met you before. It was probably about a year ago. Yeah, about a year ago. And you came in and you were so super friendly to everybody. You didn't even know these people. You were like, hi, I'm Gaga. And then you just kiss them and run off. <laughs> do you still do that? Yeah, I'm the same way. I like you know, it. Well, I, I don't know. Honestly, like, I'm never the one who wins all the awards, and I have never been the one to f feel like the winner my whole life. Mm -hmm. And I, I've always been an outsider, so I really felt like, I really felt so accepted tonight, and um, like people really understand my music and my message and what I do. You see, the things we couldn't, you can't see on the TV because of the, all the gear you've got on. Were, you, were there tears? Were you crying? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, for every single award. I, yeah, well, each one I started, and then the third one, it was a wrap. <laughs> Do you ever have a day, Lady Gaga, where you just think, right, I know I'm Lady Gaga, I know I've got to wear like this kind of thing on my head a lot, but today is Sunday, I'm going to have a dress-down day, I'm going to put some sweatpants on, I'm not, you know, going to answer my mobile phone, I'm just going to not put any makeup on, I'm just going to do, you know, the normal thing. Well, you know... It's very strange to even speak about, but you know, of course, there's days that I'm very tired, and like all of us, I work very hard. Because mm, this must take a while. Yes, but at the same time, I am my wigs, and I am the way that I dress, and my avant-garde clothing. My avant-garde clothing is a part of me, and um, it's it's something that if someone took it from me, it would, I would would not feel like a whole person. It's just the way I live my life, so. Uh. So you wouldn't feel, like, w without all this today, you wouldn't feel complete if you no. turned up at the Brit Awards? No, and that's part of why uh, the performance was so important to me tonight, mm. because um, avant-garde fashion is something that has made me feel like I belong somewhere. So um, it was very important for me to be how here How many, because it's, it's been mostly about you tonight, which is fantastic for you, how many other artists that are here tonight can you name? A lot of other artists, I, I, you know, everyone was so sweet and uh, I thought what Mika said was so nice and, you know, I will say as well um, that Florence, um, every time I see her, she is so consistently nice to me and it's very rare that you meet people in this industry that are so consistently friendly and nice. Okay. Can I just touch this? No. Oh. Okay. No. No. Will it move if I did? No. Okay. It's just not allowed? No. Okay. May I touch you? Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Um, finally, what is the first thing you think when you wake up in the morning? Because if it was me, I'd wake up, open my eyes and think, I'm freaking Lady Gaga. How brilliant is that? Um, first thing in the morning, it's usually something creative related. Okay. I sort of s sleep and dream sounds and music and the show. So when I wake up, it's just a continuation of the reckless sleep that I've had. Okay, and what are your plans for later on after you're done with this? I am going to get miserably drunk with all of my friends and celebrate and get ready. We're opening the Monster Ball this week and um, we're so excited and it's it's so brilliant and it's so amazing and I know it might be wrong to say that it's so brilliant but it, the, the show is really about liberation and freedom and I truly believe that when my fans come it's going to be a religious experience and they're going to leave so full of life and happiness. Wow. Thank you, Lady Gaga.